It is pressure cooker time in the Champions League. Four teams are left and the stage is set for an enthralling semi-final. Who will make it through to the showpiece event? It's Milan. They face Tottenham Hotspur. And the action comes your way next on EA TV. And a warm welcome from a venue that really oozes football history. I'm talking, of course, about the San Siro in Milan. I'm Derek Ray, and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And we're getting down to the wire in the UEFA Champions League. Tonight, the first leg of the semi-final coming right up. It's Milan up against Tottenham Hotspur. Well, Derek, it could be cagey and it could be tight, but we've got some of the best players on view here and they'll want to show just how good they really are. I can't wait for this tie to start. Milan team. The goalkeeper is Ciprian Tatarushanu. Sandro Tonali plays alongside Ismael Benasser in central midfield. And the starting role in attack is handed to Olivier Giroud. Starting 11 for Spurs. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Rodrigo Bentancur plays alongside Pierre Emile Heubier in central midfield. And the focal point in attack today, Harry Kane. Underway now in this Champions League semi-final first leg. Benassa. And reading it absolutely superbly. Emerson. Fabier with it. Bentancur. Kane. Now with Son. Chance here. Brilliant save. A bit sloppy in possession. And he keeps going. He could pick out a teammate. Jung Min Son, a smart stop here. Well, they fancy a short one. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Messias. It is a decent-looking attack here. And disappointing for the players of the centre that it didn't reach them.
Harry Kane. Fabier. And that'll be offside. Nasser Tonali with it Brahim still passing it around with authority corner awarded Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, good clean catch by the keeper. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Vital interception. The danger was very real. Can he put them ahead? Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Kane and Milan will get the throw in Tomori Tonali with it Teo Hernandez Diaz oh that's a really good run very straightforward for Hugo Lloris. Ivan Perisic. It's with Bentancur. Bentancur. Losing possession. Junior Messias. Tonali with it. Accepting it intelligently. Now can they make something happen? Zero! And there it is! The first goal of the semi-final! A huge moment! Extraordinary scenes! I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. And so the action continues. Will there be a response from Tottenham now? There needs to be. Kane. This looks interesting. A fine use of the ball. The cross is on. Poor pass under no real pressure. Bentancur. Rafael Leao. Textbook closing down. And still danger here. But wait a minute. That is offside. Jung Min Son. Well, now he's let that run out of play, and it will be a throw in here. A 
Gabia. Vanassa. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. A Spurs free kick it's going to be. Well, that's going to be all for the first half here at the San Siro. A really driven performance by Olivier Giroud in the first half. A standout, you've got to say, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. Second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway. Hernandez, nicely timed tackle. Javier. Perisic with the ball, real chance. And offside, well, close one. Diaz Leao and after the cross a tremendous block and the last touch off the defender so a corner coming up they take it short Diaz Tomori determined defending can they hit on the break Kane what a crucial intervention inside the box Perisic. Perisic! Well, really, making the goalkeeper's life simple. That should be hit in the back of the net. That was a big, big chance. Ficayo Tomori. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Perisic! Well, the goalkeeper's life wasn't made quite as difficult as might have been the case. Sandro Tonari Brahim Leao Teo Hernandez now Diaz giving it a try every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one and a Tottenham Hotspur free kick coming up well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Javier. Richarlison. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. I just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Kane. 
Can he find the right pass? Bentancourt, wonderful chance. Oh, good save. And a substitution in the offing. Taken short. Son. This could be the equaliser. But oh, what an important save. How about that? Well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there. They should be level now. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Well, it petered out. Bentancourt. Javier. And the precision was lacking. Throw in coming up. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. And Spurs have to be bold in these trying circumstances. Olivier Giroud. Brahim. Leal. It's with Giroud. Firing it towards goal. And danger still. Well, threat averted. Five minutes left. Well, these Milan fans are certainly playing their part here. The noise inside San Siro has been incredible. Surely the players will hold on here. It has to be. Well, what a good stop to keep them in this. Well, that would have been game over. Not long left now, though. But he's gone short with it. Diaz. Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop. Well, having been awarded the corner, they'll no doubt look to put the issue beyond all doubt. And there's the delivery. It might still be problematic. Nicely timed tackle. Oh, what an opportunity! And fired against the crossbar! Benassar. Can he finish them off? What a save! Well, that will do it. The referee blows for full time. And Milan are the side sitting in the box seat at the moment anyway. But remember, there's a return match still to be played. Well, they'll be pleased with that victory, but it's a slender lead they're taking into the second leg, and I think they'll be confident, but it's going to be tight, that's for sure. Well, there's a good reason why we're highlighting him. Really dominant in attack in this game, Stuart. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today.